Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is having an amazing week. So guys, today I am back with another karma reading for you. The topic of today's reading is um, basically based off of the energy that I've been getting for you guys this entire week, which is um, you're being freed, you're being released from a situation, okay, that from a toxic um, situation, whether that be a person, um, a job, um, a situation, you're getting out of a situation, okay, a situation that you thought you were going to be, um, you know, stuck in or, or that there was like no way to get out of it, you're actually going to be getting out of it, okay. Uh, another energy I'm getting also for you guys is um, you're getting some information, okay, or you're going to be getting some information. Um, in regards to somebody getting locked up or getting or getting put away, okay, you're going to be getting some news here. You could be a water sign watching Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. You're going to be getting some news here that somebody who you don't talk to anymore, somebody who you're definitely not talking to um, anymore, they're getting locked up or they're going to jail, okay? Yeah, bottom of the deck is the magician. Um, well, I had the magician and then I had um, the eight of wands. Let's see, guys. Let's go ahead and see. Go ahead and spirit and um, please let us know. All right, guys, so the first card coming out, I have temperance, okay? So, yeah, so with temperance here, um, I feel like you guys are, you know, balancers. You could be a Libra watching, um, or, you, or you could be an air sign, okay? Um, I just really feel like this news that you're getting ready to find out is going to be something that you've been waiting for okay this news that, that you know that you're going to find out is something that's going to bring you peace or it's going to bring you a satisfaction or you're going to be like yes like you're going to feel like this news that you're finding out is justice okay that this person getting locked up is justice or you getting free or or getting out of a situation um finally is your justice this is going to be something that's very satisfactory for you or something that is okay if this has already happened for you guys i have two cards coming out here let's see okay so actually i have three i have the tower the ten of cups and the page of pentacles Okay. All right. All right, guys. So I see here, yes, this person who who is going away, this, this, um, I feel like something has exposed this person bringing them this massive tower here. Okay. Um, this person, they're losing their family. This person could be losing you. Okay. And then with the page of pentacles, this person is, um, they're doing tarot readings on you. They're finding out that you're happily ever after with somebody else, that you're fine, and they're wanting to ruin your your family. They're wanting to separate your family. This person, they're, they're jealous of you because they're, this person, they're getting ready to have to go away, or they know that this cycle of them playing this game is over with you. They're getting karma. Like, you're in a cycle of temperance, of, of peace, joy, harmony, abundance, everything beautiful, everything abundant, everything heavenly. And then I have the um, the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so this is, again, a very abundant time for you here. Okay. I'm just really getting like somebody is th this person who is receiving this massive block um, physically, emotionally, spiritually, financially. This person who is experiencing this massive block, they're extremely jealous of you. They're they're on the outside looking in, watching you live your best life, um, watching you be in union here. OK, they're watching you be in union here. 
with your twin flame, okay? This is also this person's karma is watching you be um be in this temperance energy all while they're going through these massive towers back to back, okay? Let's go ahead and get an oracle, guys. I'm going to use my oracle deck here, okay? This is the um, Enchanted Map Oracle deck we're going to be using here to clarify this reading. Yeah, I feel like you guys are getting out of a situation. The situation that you're getting out of, you're finally being set free from it. You're like, like this is going to bring you such satisfaction, such peace. It's going to be like a big burden um, lifted from your shoulders, okay? This is something that you've been waiting for for a long time. I have filled the dreams at the bottom of my deck. So this is something that you've been dreaming for here, hoping for to come in, okay? And it's finally coming in and um you know it's bringing you this satisfaction here okay yeah and then because one of your dreams of being in union and and you know having that life partner having having that like that significant other that you can call your own this dream is coming true. This is why this Ten of Cups is here. This person, they're on the outside looking in. They're watching you live your best life. They're jealous. They're they're getting put away. You're finding out that they're getting locked up where you're going to. All this is happening. Um, yeah, I have Into the Unknown coming out, okay? So all of these good things are happening for you. Meanwhile, this person, they have no idea what's going on, like what to expect next. Like they're just getting karma. They're getting towers back to back. Things are getting taken from them. They're they're not sure how like this person, they're confused as to how you're moving forward, as to how you're still doing good, as to how you're getting this Ten of Cups temperance peace the happy home the happy life the perfect partner all all of this good stuff is happening to you meanwhile they're over here getting tower moments they're they're having problems with the justice system um probably on the run they're getting caught up for something legally dealing with legal situations and disputes um um person losing custody of their children um getting fired from jobs having a hard time holding on to money. Yeah, this person, they're experiencing a dry desert of, lo of loss of everything. They're in the five of pentacles energy, depressed. They have nothing. Their karma is they're going to be poverty stricken. Okay, yeah, bottom of my deck here, deep freeze. They're going to be poverty stricken. Okay. Um, because of what they did to you, because they tried to stop you, they tried to take your place, that they tried to stop you from going into union, um, they tried to interfere in your relationships, they gang stalked you, they tried to block your money, um, tried to interfere in your family life, okay, um, yeah, this person, they're getting, they're going to be experiencing this massive block, okay, like, they're getting stopped right in their tracks. Everything for them is going to just automatically stop. Meanwhile, everything for you is going to automatically pick up, okay? So if things were slow for you, they're going to they're gonna pick back up again. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, guys. Um, let's go ahead and pull a kipper here and see. Yeah, you're getting free out of a situation here, okay? Whether this be a toxic relationship, you're getting out of that. This, and you're going into union with somebody who's going to appreciate you, okay? With work, if you're if you're going through a hard time at work with a boss um, or with an employee, Spirit is saying that this employee who's been causing you problems at work, they're getting ready to be fired. Um, the card coming out is bad health, okay? So yeah, with bad health here. This person's karma is there. They also could be finding out that they've, um, you know, that they're sick. They're, they could be diagnosed with with an illness that's not curable. Okay, this person could be bed bedridden, or this illness that they have is gonna put them um, in the hospital. Okay, I'm seeing um, breathing tubes, guys. This came out for my last reading. Okay, a few days ago here, the person who's done you harm. Okay, every time that they attempt to do any type of magic on you, or any time that they um, attempt to do despair at the bottom of my deck, anything to try to put you in this despair, five of pentacles, remorse, sad energy, the person, they get sick like the next week, okay? And this person, they could be finding out that they're sick. They could also be finding out that, that they have a, a child, okay, um, that they didn't know was theirs. Okay, like a DNA test is coming out on this person from, from a karmic party that they 
were with before. And then I have poverty coming out. So this is just, yeah, this person, they're going to be poverty stricken for the next 10 years, okay? They're going to be in this despair energy here, um, losing out on things, getting ghosted, um, not being able to experience love in this lifetime, um, not being financially stable, okay? Not having a home. I'm seeing somebody getting put out of a home here, okay? And then this, and then this illness that this person is getting is getting diagnosed with or being diagnosed with there's no cure it it leads to to death here with the coffin i'm seeing okay so you're gonna find out that somebody around you has either went to jail or they passed away but whatever the energy like whatever the news may be that the news brings you peace or joy or something that it like feels like a weight is lifted off your shoulder. That's the kind of energy I'm getting for you. Let me go ahead and use this deck, guys. I have the Witch's Wisdom deck. So I just got this deck today and I want to use it and see. So we're going to pull um, three cards from it, okay? And see what Spirit has to say. You're getting free out of a situation, okay? Some news that you're finding out is... It's so much of a of a it's kind of like a miracle that it happened like you're you're gonna be very ha excited about this okay um it's gonna bring a peace like a peace over you okay whatever the news may be it's gonna bring a peace over for you but for the other person the news it's gonna bring them despair and anxiety and stress and fear and worry because it's them that's in trouble but them being in trouble is justice for you. So you see what I'm saying? It brings you like a peace, like a like a justice being served type of a feeling, like an energy for you, okay? Bottom of the deck for you guys, I have remembrance, okay? So with ancestors and remembrance here. You guys have a really strong ancestor in your field, okay? Um, this ancestor has been with you in many, many lifetimes, many past lives, okay? This person has been by your side. Um, this is a very close person to you. It's definitely a very close person to you. If you look here in this picture, there's somebody right beside you here, okay? Um, this ancestor, they have a promise to you okay a promise that they're wanting to make sure that in this lifetime you get to experience having the ten of cups the ten of pentacles okay and being unstopped um being unblocked on this journey here okay this life journey while we're here at this time okay i have witch healer at the bottom of my deck here when i split it so let's go ahead and grab the first two I have spell manifestation. Okay, so you guys, there could be some black magic being done here on you. Okay, by this uh, person on the outside looking in, they're 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 very jealous and envious of you, what you have. Um, they're envious of your ten of cups, your temperance, your ten of pentacles. How beautiful you are, how gorgeous you are, how you how you always get what you want. They're jealous. They want to take that from you. Um, this person, they're doing magic to try to cause tower moments. And every time that they do this magic to cause you this um, stress and remorse and despair, they get sick. And now they're being diagnosed with the illness that there's no cure for it. And it, it results in death, unfortunately. Guys, I don't know who that's for, but that's what I'm getting. And then I have... Beltane fertility. So this person could be doing magic on your womb space. Like, guys, I've been getting this energy for like the past couple of months that I never really spoke on it here, okay, on my channel. But I'm going to go ahead and speak on it now because I feel like for the Divine Feminines, if you guys are in union with with your masculine, um, there is a karmic that you do not deal with anymore, that you do not talk to anymore, that's getting locked up or they're going to get locked up or they're going to pass away or they're finding out that they have, they have illness that's going to cause them to pass away. This person, they're jealous of you. They could be doing magic to try to stop your finances, your love life and your womb space, your fertility. 
your ability to get pregnant. They're probably trying to um, throw your cycles off, cause you to have issues with intimacy. Okay, things like that I'm getting. Um, you guys need to do like a solar plexus clear and a root chakra clearing. Okay, meditation, cleaning, um, cleansing. Do, do your spiritual baths as well, okay? Yeah, um, I was going to grab three cards, but I grabbed four. Spirit said, I have boundaries coming out with the sword. Yeah, Spirit is saying you need to protect yourself, but they're also clarifying that you are... You know, just protect yourself how you how you are by, you know, doing your spiritual baths, doing your clearing work, um, listening to your Reiki meditations, um, you know, carrying your crystals, wearing wearing your protective jewelry, doing your healing work. Keep doing that. But spirit is just clarifying for you that you are protected, okay, as well. So this work's not gonna um so this magic that these people are attempting to do on you. Um, it can't work anymore, okay? I don't think that they know that, though. This person, they don't know when to stop, okay? Um, let's get a message from this person, guys. You can be dealing with the fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. All right, Spirit, please give us a message from this person that's doing this magic. Okay. I'm a Libra. So the person, they could be a Libra or this person could be going to jail. I feel like this person, they're dealing with the justice system right now. Like they're in trouble and they regret doing what they did. Okay. Because at this, I feel like this person, they got themselves in a situation that they can't get themselves out of now. I saw, I want to talk to you. So this person, they want to speak to you. This person could be a fire sign. Like I said, I have Aries coming out. Um, Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And then bottom of the deck, please talk to me. They want to talk to you here. I feel like this person, they want to apologize. Because now that they that you seriously have nothing to deal with them, like you don't speak to them, like this person, they disgust you. Now this person, they feel like you're their twin flame. It says, I know you're my soulmate, my twin flame. So this person, they feel like you're their twin flame after they did all of this work they're going to jail they're losing everything they're broke they're homeless like it took this person losing everything and it took this person like attacking you this much to realize that you're still good and that like you're still like the divine feminine or the divine masculine like you're still protected like you're still gonna have what you have whether it, they like it or not so this person they did all of this stuff and realize that they can't defeat you. They can't win with you. You all, you're, you're too strong for them. You're too powerful for them. Now that they tried all of this stuff, now they want to say, "Oh well, I can't beat them." So this, you must be my soulmate, my twin flame. So now this person is obsessed with you. I feel like they're watching you from a distance. Let's get a random message, guys. This is insane. I was not expecting this energy, but I feel like, yeah, you guys are being freed from this toxic karmic partner. You could have kids with this person. It's a test. So many, so many plays too much, okay? They feel like everything's a joke. Everything's a game. They don't take things seriously, this person. This Aries fire sign. And then I'm, I'm hearing Taurus. Like, I just, like, they just scream Taurus. So you could be dealing with the Taurus or you could be, let's see. I don't really have what I told you I had. So this person is a liar. This person is a master manipulator. They play too much. And then this it says they're going to tell on themselves. So this person, they expose themselves. I feel like this person, they did something. Yeah. And they're watching you with secret admirer coming out. This person, they exposed themselves. They did something while under the influence of something, some type of an alcohol or a drug. They did something while under the influence. They exposed themselves. They talked too much. They, they told on themselves. They got themselves caught up. Now they're dealing with the legal system or this is going to result in a legal system. You're going to find out that this person is going to jail. This, this news is going to make you happy. And if it's not that energy, then this person, they're, they're doing all of this to attack you. They're attacking your womb space, causing your cycles to be off, causing your fertility problems, causing you um, intimacy issues, um, causing um, conflict and chaos between you and your partner. You guys might be fighting a little bit more. This is conflict magic. Do, do some clearing and saging in your home um, for whoever that resonates for. But this person is doing all of this magic, all of this spell work. 
out of jealousy because you're the true divine feminine or masculine and they want to be you but they're not you so this person could be trying to take on your persona guys i'm getting a whole lot of different messages here all at the same time for you guys but this person they could be finding out that they're sick and this sick energy um that they're in is gonna um you know resolve this person unfortunately passing away and like I said, this news, the news that's coming out is good for you, but it's bad for them. Okay. And then a problem I have is increase, an increase of finances. Okay. I feel like this person, they need money. Um, this person, you know, because of all of this theft, this thief energy, this sneaky snake like energy here, this person, um, they're in this five of pentacles energy that they wanted you to be in. They're broke. They're needing money here now. They spent all of their money doing the spell work. They spent money, uh, you know, trying to steal from you. Yeah, spell work, black magic confusion spells coming out. This confirmation right here. They spent money doing all this trying to ruin you. But, the, you know, there's an ending of this karmic cycle. They can't do that anymore. You're protected. Like I said, you're being free from this person. You don't have to deal with this person ever again. Like ever again. You don't have to worry about this person. No more spirit is saying. Let's go ahead and get some karma for this person, guys, okay? And then we'll get some advice from spirit and we'll close out for today. All right, spirit, if you would please give us a karma for this person, these people that are doing this to my viewers. You guys, this is my personal karma deck, my Queen Tati Tarot karma deck. If you would like to purchase, um, you can look down in my description box. I will have my description so you can click on the link and you can purchase for yourself at my store. Okay, but um, let's go ahead and get the karma spirit for this person that is attacking my viewers here and trying to ruin their ten of cups, messing with their room space, interfering in their relationships, stealing their money, trying to do magic to block their finances, their love life, trying to steal their peace. I have two coming out, guys. I have things are happening to them, not for them, okay? So a lot of things that's happening to this person, okay, um, it's what they get. This is what they deserve. This is what they get. And, and when these things are happening to this person, they feel like you're doing magic on them, okay? But it's not. It's just, the, you know, the reversals are working and you're protected. So whatever magic they do, it goes um, automatically back to the sender. And this person, they can't figure out why this is happening, but this is happening to them, Okay, this is what they get. And then the next one says, they got put into a third party situation without knowing that they were. So guys, again, like I said, if this was your um, karmic partner or your ex-karmic partner, this person has a third party that they're dealing with. Okay, um, the person, you know, could be, t you know, well, they could be finding out that they have a child with someone Okay, I'm getting that energy. Um, but this person, they're they're in a third party. If they put you in a third party situation, well, surprise, now they are. They have to feel what it was like to be um put in a third party situation and then left out in the cold and abandoned and forgot about. So this is what's um this is how spirit's teaching this person not to hurt others because um that energy will be returned back to you. All right, spirit, give us some more karma for this person, please. Thank you. Drop a card, guys. Give me one second. All right, so I have is bound up and tied down. Hashtag chained, hashtag blocked, hashtag stagnated. So this person, they're stuck, okay? um, They're going to be blocked. Like I said, this person, they're going to be experiencing massive blocks, massive towers, massive problems, chaos and confusion all in their life. Meanwhile, you're over here having peace, harmony, and joy, being in this temperance energy, okay? This person is losing everything that they love and worked hard for, everything is being pulled, taken from them, okay? This is like I said, like I said earlier, the, the universe, God, the divine, they had to teach this person how to sit down, how to stop playing these games. The only way that this person was going to learn how to stop was if everything was stripped from them, which is what's happening now. Okay, so meanwhile, things are being stripped from them. You're getting things given to you. You're getting blessed and this person's getting cursed. You see what I'm saying? This is why it pays to stay in the, uh, you know, stay in your lane, stay in a high vibration. 
do the right thing. Treat people how you want to be treated. And then two, know how know how karma works and just know that you know what goes around comes around is simple basics of life spirit do you have any advice for us today okay in regards to the situation this reading thank you we'll go ahead and um get our advice guys and we'll close out our reading well congratulations to you guys you know on getting set free getting out of these situations here and you know, finally experiencing what you've deserved this entire time, okay? Spirit's wanting you just to continue healing your heart, to continue, um, you know, being strong and keeping your head up and staying positive, okay? They're saying to go ahead and grab this. Yeah, I have the one. You've met or are going to meet your soulmate. So this is just confirmation right here, guys. You're going into union, okay? If you haven't already, you are. And this person is going to be everything to you, okay? Everything for you. This is this person is going to fill your void and heal you. You're getting set free. You've officially ended a karmic cycle, okay? So you're being set free from this toxic karmic partner you were dealing with before. You never had to deal with this person again. Um, you know, if it's a friend or a family member, you're getting set free. You're, you're done with that person. And now you're you're moving on to bigger and better things, okay? But I just, I just want to say congratulations, guys, to you for that. No, you come a long way it's been a long journey you know there was a lot of times you didn't you didn't you know know if there would ever be a light at the end of the tunnel but but surprise there here it is here it is you you made it into new earth and you're going to experience new earth with your twin flame and you don't have to worry about a third party or anybody on the outside trying to interfere with you because your relationship is protected there is no more karmic cycle for you, ever. You've completed your karmic cycle on this planet. Now, all you have is a field of dreams, heaven on earth, temperance, balance, harmony, success, peace, joy, abundance, overflow. This is your fairy tale. This is your final destination. This is your promise. I hope you guys enjoy the reading. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll be talking to you guys later. Bye.